video you're gonna do your own shredded and distressed jeans we're gonna make this half of your jeans look like this half all you're gonna need is a pair of scissors and a pair of tweezers you won't need these if you do not want this at the top of your pants that's what your tweezers are gonna be for so if you need this then you're gonna need some tweezers so first we're just gonna do your first cut even with the other half of your pants that's the only cut that you have to make sure is even. So don't, don't worry about them being uneven or distressed. Just make sure you do them as far as apart as you want them. And you're just gonna cut and cut and cut. Make sure you don't cut the other half of your jeans. We're gonna just keep cutting. And I'm gonna do this to the other whole half of this jeans and then I'll be right back. Alright guys, so I'm going to do this last little part with you. As you can see, I cut all the jean. They're all cut. They're all different sizes. Doesn't matter. I'm just going to cut these last little bit here. And now you have your shred look. Now in order to achieve it to look this way, you're going to need to put it in the washer and the dryer at least twice. So once it's in there twice, it'll start to just kind of shred on its own. The more you wash it, the more stressed and shredded it will look. So after that, I kind of just take my scissors, or you can take a knife if you have one, and just kind of do this a little bit to it, and that'll give it the stringy, more distressed look. Do that for as long as you want. It doesn't really matter. When you put it in the washer and dryer, it'll just stress it for you. I just do this just to stretch out the jean material where it's been cut at. So once you wash it, maybe once or twice, you'll have this look. Now we're gonna show you how to do your top distress holes here. If you don't want them, you don't have to do them. All you need is two slits. Depending on where you want them, you can just fold your pants, just fold it and cut as long, as big as you want your hole to be, is as far as down you're gonna cut. You have to have a top and a bottom slit in order to achieve the hole distress. It should look like this. You can make them as big or as small as you want them. This is where your tweezers will come in. There's gonna be some lines in here some of your lines go up and down and some go sideways. You're gonna need to pull out the ones that go up and down. It's kind of hard at the beginning, but once you get the hang of it, it goes faster. So you should start to see your shred appear there. 
the more you do, the more you will start to see them. So you should be able to see so how some of these are coming out right here. And you'll do this to the whole area of the jeans. You just pull out the ones that are going up and down. Try not to rip out the ones that are going sideways because you're gonna need that in order to see, achieve the look. So you see how that is starting to look a little distressed like these ones. You can go up and down, take the ones that are straight or you can take the ones that are sideways. Only do one or the other. Do not pull both. If you do, it's okay. It's just gonna look like a distressed hole, which is fine. So you'll just pull these out more and more with your tweezers and throw the strands away. And then once you're done with your distress all the way through, you just take your scissors and kind of distress your sides here so that they don't look so even. And you can do as many as those as possible, as many wherever you want. You can distress your zipper, you can distress this area, you can distress anything you want. And then if you want it on your pocket, which I did on this one, you can also distress your pocket using the same method. But that's all, that's the only, it's simple. It takes a little while, it's not too bad. The only thing that's gonna take you a while is doing your distress part. But once you get the hang of it, it's not hard at all. You just pull out these little things and just keep going. Use your tweezers, it's a lot easier than using your hands unless you, unless you have long nails. So just keep doing that, throw them in the washer, and keep on going. So after you guys try this, send me some pictures. Comment below, like, and subscribe. And my next video will be on how you can distress a shirt to match these jeans. Until then, guys, I'll see you next time. Hair by Bang.